Hello, my name is Melissa Taranto, and today I will be selling a new product called the Soap Bottle. And this product is a liquid and bar soap that comes in packaging made from bar soap. And once the liquid content is finished inside the bottle, the empty container can then be used as a hand soap, and this will be washed away over time. So waste can be completely avoided, and you don't have to worry about throwing any containers or plastic or anything towards the end. So today I will be selling to Rachel Leary, who is the manager of Bath & Body Works in Allentown, Pennsylvania. I will be talking to her today since her company is very much related to the product. Bath & Body Works is a widely known bath shop and retail company with many chains worldwide. They provide hand and body soaps, candles, hand sanitizers, and perfumes with a wide variety of different scents. And with the sales call objective, I met with Rachel at her store in Allentown a couple weeks prior to this meeting. I researched some local Bath & Body Works companies and found that she is the store manager at one of the local stores. So once I got in contact with her at the store, I asked if we can possibly plan a sales meeting to sell her a new product I was selling. And she agreed, and I asked if she was available next week to meet and asked for her contact information via email and phone number. And afterwards, I contacted her via email, and we're going to be doing a Zoom call since the pandemic. So first for the report building, I will first shake her hand, and I will say, hello, Rachel, and ask, how is she doing today? She will then respond, I am doing pretty well today. How about yourself? Then I would respond, I'm also doing well, thank you. It's gorgeous out today. Um, do you have any plans for this weekend? And she'll respond, yes, I'll be hiking in the mountains with my husband for a little weekend getaway since she just had her first daughter three months ago. And I, I'll say, that sounds so fun. I love camping and hiking also. And then I'll ask her, how has, it be, how has it been being a new mother? And she'll respond, it's pretty difficult, but I'm very excited to spend the weekend with my husband and have some freedom being a mother from being a mother for a little bit this weekend. So then I'll say, I definitely feel you on that. And I just want to ask you a couple questions before we get started. So my first need determination is how long have you worked at Bath and Body Works? And she'll respond, I started as a cashier in 2017 during my last year of college. I graduated and received my bachelor's degree to then work my way up to becoming the general manager of the store this past year in January. And my next question would be, your store has products such as soaps, lotions, perfumes, and candles, correct? And she would respond, yes, we have a wide variety of selection for different scents and colors in all forms. So I'd say, awesome. That, so which product makes the most sales for your business? And she would say, hand soaps and hand sanitizers ever since COVID hit. And we have many sales such as buy one, get one free towards the holidays. And then I would ask, are your hand soaps made of plastic? And she responds, yes, they can be recycled. And we also have soap holders to put the hand soap containers in. Then I will ask what her net sale is for the company. And she responds, this year our net sale is around 25000 at our local store, but around $4 billion with our chain stores nationally. And 
Listening to that, I then ask, are you making more sales in-store or online? And she'll respond, online, but more customers are starting to come into store to test products and look around. It's been pretty difficult in-store because of the pandemic, but it's great to see more customers come in the store now. Then I'll ask, is your company doing well with sales or are you struggling ever since the pan pandemic came in effect? And she'd say, we could be doing better, but since we provide a lot of hand soaps and sanitizers, this promotion has helped us since the main product is hand soap during the pandemic, since everyone wants to wash their hands along with hand sanitizers. And then I would ask, do customers complain about the products being too expensive, or do you promote a lot of sales year-round? And she would respond, customers are usually satisfied with our product prices, although sometimes it can be a little pricier. And she tries to promote a lot of sales closer to the holidays or with new seasons occurring. Then I ask how much her hand soaps are usually in the store. And usually, separately, her hand soaps are around $8. And then... I asked the final question, would you purchase a product that is eco-friendly and a little on the pricier side, but lasts for a longer period for your customers? And then she responds with the objection, it sounds great, but I may have to think about it. So then I pause, look at her body language, and then I say, I understand, so you need to think about buying this product. And she says, yes, I just need to think if this is the right product for our store right now. And then I go into explaining into detail a little more about the product. And I say, the soap bottle is a new liquid and bar soap that comes in packaging made from soap. So the products are made of natural ingredients and can be used for your hands or your body. You can pour and seal the bar of soap. And once the liquid soap is finally finished, the empty container can then be used as hand soap. So over time, the bar of soap can be washed away and you don't need to, be wor you don't need to worry about any waste left behind. So after I explain that, she listens, she nods her head, writes a few notes, and I wait a little bit and I ask, so do we have an agreement? And then she responds, honestly, yes, after listening to more information you just told me about the product, I think this product would be a perfect fit for our store. And I used the agreement closed since she stated an objection, and I told her some more information on the product, and she agreed with it, that it would be worth it and useful for more sales in her store.